Evaluate the expression below when x is 11. Sorry, I read that wrong. When x is 5 and y is 1. Express your answer as a fraction. What I'm going to tell you about problems like these is that with Desmos, they're very, very easy, but you have to remember one thing. Always put parentheses around what's above the division symbol, okay? So you want to make sure that your numerator is surrounded by parentheses. So I'm going to put xy, close my parentheses, divided by 2 times x plus y. Now I'm going to go to my next line and I'm going to tell my calculator what it needs to know. It needs to know that x is equal to 5. Next line, it needs to know that y is equal to 1. And it will automatically fill it in for you. Now, it wants your answer as a fraction, which makes things a little bit different. We have it here as a decimal. So if you are able to change that back to a fraction, you can. But I can also show you a way that um, you can make it work in both situations where you can go ahead and put it as a fraction. So if you put xy in, okay, just by itself, it's going to give you a 5. So you know that the numerator is five. Then I'm gonna go ahead and go to the next line on my calculator, and I'm gonna put in the bottom, two x plus y. That tells me it's 11, okay? So I can split it up the way I did on Desmos, where I tell it what x is, I tell it what y is, I put in the numerator, what's above the division, separately from what's below, or you could put it all in together and get a decimal. But if it's specifically asking you for a fraction, you're just going to have to split it up. Okay? If you remember that, you'll be able to get every problem. Not hard at all. You can do this.